it's Sunset Looms here and I'm back for another extremely late update that I am very sorry for. <sighs> I don't even know what's going on anymore, honestly. I promised myself I was going to make a video every weekend, but that did not happen. Like, at all. And I'm sorry. So yeah, I will actually be making part of the dragon in this video again. Making, you're going to be making four of his little feet. So yeah, that's gonna be fun, and I am once again so sorry. I don't know what's going on with me. Can't keep my motivation for these videos. Okay, so anyways, let's get started. Okay. To start, you're going to do a six loop magic ring. So just put three rings around your hook. Take one band of your body color. Pull the band through that. Then make a gentle slip knot. Go back inside the three rings. And then make a single crochet, which is where you just pull the band through. Grab the other end, pull the first through the second and third. Do that four more times and come back to me once you're done with that. You're just going to take your stitch marker. Oh my goodness, I'm having a hard time again. Put it on your final band. And close it. You can use a C clip, S clip, or a stitch marker. Doesn't really matter. Then what you're going to do is go into your first loop here, and we're going to make an increase, which all you have to do is make two single crochets in the same stitch. Bring one band through, first through second and third, then go back in the same stitch you were just in. One band through, first through second and third. Do that the whole way around your single I mean your uh, magic ring and then come back to me once you're done with this row. So you finish that row of full increases you're going to go into your first stitch and we're going to start a full single crochet round. Just go in, bring a band through, reclaim first through second and third. Do that the whole way around and come back to me when you are done. Okay now that you've finished those increase row I mean just singular rows you're going to be going into your first one, and you're going to be doing a single, single decrease row. So go in your first, bring a single crochet for, through, and then go in your second stitch, bring another single crochet through that one. Then you're going to go into the back loop of your fourth stitch, then the back loop of your third stitch. Pull the band through to make your decrease. Do that the whole way around and come back to me when you're done. Once you finish, you're going to go into one stitch over from the last one, pull a band through everything on your hook, and slip knot it. Then you're going to take out your um, stitch holder, and there is your foot. You can stuff it with a tiny bit of stuffing to make it nice. Just make sure you put in not too much, not too little, just enough to fill it up a decent amount. You're going to make three more of these and come back to me when you are done. Once you have finished your three other feet, you are officially ready to um, start moving on to the head and the body, which will be in the next video. I will be posting most likely is it tomorrow or next weekend. So thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe, like, and hit that little bell button so you know when my next video for this um, design comes out. And if you like my designs or have any suggestions, make sure to comment and give me some ideas. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. Bye!